Hello Feb! A bit late in the month, yes, but still wanted to drop my comments here. Well, beginning of month, we were kept busy while our current government in the US can finish its most important national discourse on impeachment. Hope that conversation was useful to someone and somewhere. Now we can move on to the rest of the year, right? With important matters like this month, for example, celebration of Black History Month, with genuine efforts of healing race relations that had also been exasperated by our partisan government, to say the least. The last time I made commentary on my platform on race and people of color was during the killing of George Floyd last year. 2020, as we know it, saw a resurgence in social activism and conversations about anti-racism. The hashtag Black, Black Lives Matter movement was the spotlight and certainly got everyone's attention globally. For a century, the Black History Month was kept aside as a way to recognize the achievements of people of African descent, those who stood against injustice, broke barriers and bridges of race, class, and gender, and brought diversity in schools, workplaces, politics, etc., and helped us pull through as a nation and overcome our darker states. I see the media particularly this month, and businesses making efforts to bring much light to the people of color. What a great learning experience has it been for me and for all of us of this generation, whatever race, color, and religion we are. I know for sure my African history can be represented by the legendary Emperor Haile Selassie of Ethiopia, who successfully fought against colonialism, not only his in his country, but overall for Africa. We will never forget that. These people and so many others help us build towards a greater nation where people are judged by the content of their character, not the color of their skin. We celebrate how far we've come as a society, but we also honor those who continue the struggle today for the struggle continues. As Dr. Martin Luther King Jr would say, or have said, darkness cannot drive out darkness, right? Only light can do that. Hate cannot also drive out hate. Only love can do that. Hence, it is all work to be the light that drives our darkness. So this month can be a much more than 28 days of social media hype or simply posting a Martin Luther King Jr. quote. 2021 can be the extension of this occasion that allows us to pause and reflect on the fight to make life better and equal for all people of color, not only decades ago, but today as this moment. It is about what can we do to do this, disseminate information about the lives, culture, and history of people of color to the world. What our society needs right now is a positive representation, particularly in the powerful media. We need to see more doctors, innovators, creators, entrepreneurs, and hard workers that are of color, given as much spotlight than those who identify with the Anglo-Saxon origin, or referred to as in the US as white people. We have moved a step closer in the right direction, but there is a lot more work to be done. Let peace be with humanity around the world. We certainly need each other. My slant for Feb on my IGTV channel. See you next time. Have a great weekend with much love. Ciao.